can. Hold on, let me show you my chart. Okay, good. Can you see it? Yes, I can see it. That's Baidu, right? Baidu, how are you today? You made mm -hmm. almost two grand, I, that's great. I did, Melissa, it's amazing. It was, a, a, you know, the, between the options and the shorts, I, I'm really doing well. So how much are you risking now? Cause I, I know you've been back and forth, back and forth, back and right. forth with this. So the risks <laughs> with shorts still is um, $200 per trade and we're willing to lose $200 per trade on each trade. So a, a loss for the day of $400 at the most. So you're doing two trades a day, $200 a piece. Yes, the loss, but like like with Baidu, so you, I size myself, but I still, when it goes like Baidu did, I, I made more. And then I went into Baidu twice. Yeah, but I'm saying like you're not going to lose any more than two hundred dollars. Is that with the options too? Yes. Uh, options. You know, I, I, I haven't. We really haven't figured out. I haven't figured out the options because I'm I'm kind of new to it. All I've been doing is, and actually, well, let's talk about the Apple. Last let's two weeks. The options you called, we really haven't lost. I, I know. <laughs> I know. That's why. I, you're like, oh, I, I mistakenly took double the size. I mean, that was that. I mean, that's like, I mean, that's the kind of stuff. I mean, yeah, it's great when it works, but you still have to be aware of that. Now, so yeah. you took well, this. This was down, though. This was down Friday, and you took two of this, the apple. Yes, because you called it first thing in the morning, and Fridays I work. So what I was oh, doing okay. was, because I was in work, I was trying to get the, the options to Ben so that he could do them from his phone mm -hmm. because he does stuff from his phone all the time and I don't. Okay. I've learned how to get out of things on my phone but not get into things on my phone. Okay. So I was at work and I, I was in there early so I put the order out for an Apple and then I I was going to I was going to tweak the limit price and I wound up putting another order so when it filled, it filled for two contracts. <laughs> That's funny. So, <laughs> so it really worked out. So when I when I opened it this morning, I was, oh my land. So how much did you make in that? So how much did you make an apple alone? Seven hundred and fifty four dollars an apple. Okay. Now, so if I got out when it bottomed this morning, I was over a thousand. But you know, we were in Baidu and I couldn't do two things. I know there's a lot so, going on. Oh my, yeah, well, I'm. That's something I sort of touched on that this morning in the room. You can estimate what you think it is and just put an order out in the morning. It and again, it right. may not be where it may not be the exact low, but it's kind of you can estimate where you think it's going. And I did feel that 180 was definitely definitely doable, and it got almost yeah. there. 180 28. You it know. Did. Um, the, the only thing I can tell you is that, like, I put limit orders out today on the spy in the queues. For um, so so Ben Ben usually targets seventy percent profit on the options. That's like a good number for him. So that's what I did. I put limit orders out on the spy and the queues for seventy percent, and I kind of have a feeling it's it's gonna get there. I mean, I, I no, I mean, no, these like, things are lower. If you didn't get out of everything today, fine. If you did, fine. But you got out of Baidu all around, right? Because this is this is that's even right. yeah. I mean, this is probably lower too. But I mean, what a great exit, even if you got out of this today. Yes, Ben did that option for me on Friday. So he was in it and then got out of it, and that's not how, how he made the $456 in the Baidu option in his one contract. Okay, all right. So all in all, you're risking about 400 in the options and 200 in the day trades. Is that what you're risking? Yes, and I also have a new chart with the different stop losses on it. Mm -hmm. To kind of give me, you know, so in other words, if it's a 20 cent stop loss, mm -hmm. it's a, I take a thousand shares. Say if it's an 80 cent stop loss, I take 250 shares. Okay. <clears throat> All right. Well, then that's good. Yes. So, um, you know, at least until I build everything like up to a certain level. And then Ben said, we'll revisit it again. So, because I, what you really made me think when you said, what's your risk? And I went, well, you know, and then I'm saying, well, shares really isn't risk. Like just because you look at the shares, the amount, how much a share is. Mm -hmm. So then it kind of like my, the light bulb when I went, oh, I know what she means. Well, 
when the stop between the entry and the stop that's really my risk right exactly but i mean you yeah. weren't i don't think you were ever making that mistake which some people in the room were like carl was and then he fixed it now he's had a big month but i mean right. you know i think i think that whatever the month was i don't even remember now like february march whatever where if, I, if we take two trades and the first two fail in the morning and you have to take a third trade, well, then that's where you say, okay, well, wait a minute. So if, if we take, right. if for some reason we're having a bad morning and the first trade fails and the second trade fails, are you then not doing a third trade? Then that, I'm done. Okay. I'm done. Okay. Yeah, that's, and the other thing I found was if I put a limit order, like I did put a limit order this morning on, on the second trade on Baidu, mm -hmm. and I put it for, I put for 117 I should have probably done it for 11750 but like but it almost takes the emotion out of it for me you mean to you know, get you out of it after, you mean to get you out yeah. after you're in it well that yeah. yeah if that works for you yeah because sometimes I'm just waiting for it to go down 10 more and set yeah <laughs> yeah so. Well, I mean, honestly, this was easy, though, today. I mean, I didn't even look at where the low was in this. 117.24, but if you look the way this closed, right. it almost like it ran out of day. Like, this would have probably broken 117. No, it did. Oh, look here, 117.16. That was about 3.15 in the afternoon. Right. So this would have, if you if you stayed in it all day, um, actually, could have done this another time, too. I'm looking at this here now. I didn't go back and look at this, but looks like this this would have broke 117 if it had if it, it was just traded out till six o'clock i mean this is lower probably tomorrow but i still think this is a great exit i think you're doing well i mean i wouldn't increase your risk here now once earnings season no. is over before the next earnings season but i mean by the time the july rolls around if you feel confident no. you, maybe you can increase your risk for the day trades up to 300 you know i mean so right. you know once you start to be more consistent yeah. Yeah, it's just, um, you know, so the apple was a, an unintended surprise, but it, you know, and like it worked, but I, I just feel like, like, so we were doing call options like a month or two ago and they were working and now the market's totally like changed and now we're doing puts and they're kind of working too. So it's fun to learn and yet, and, and to keep my hand in the shorts, like the, you know, and the Baidu option reminded me a lot of the MGM when we went in that three times, remember? For the day trade Not you're three. talking about, because I didn't call any options of the MGM. Right, yeah. no. But, but when something works like that, that's the way I felt about Baidu today, it was just oh, like the yeah. MGM. You just got to go with it, because so many days, you know, we'll get a day that doesn't work. So when you get a day that it's it's falling three times and you know go for it that's the way i, I know and i mean i honestly felt like it was just too fast to turn it around over like some people did do apple and baidu as day trades which because i both liked them both right out of the gate but i mean right. we've been i've been doing so i mean every, almost every trade that i'm calling is working sometimes you're just like you know you got to take a step back and breathe and say okay you yes. know am i really 100 percent sure i want to do another one of this today like i mean it's just and then you know and then it's there and then you do it but i mean honestly like taking a step back after your booking money booking money booking money booking money but i mean it's just like you're like okay is everything's good okay like it's kind of like that yeah. like i'm very aware of checking myself now like not to you know i mean i'm like just i'm that's what i said this morning i'm like i'm even more focused now because like every trade that i'm calling is working i'm like uh, you know like i'm really like making sure that they're good before i'm even calling them because we're just it's like we can do no wrong you know, I oh no, and, and you know, <laughs> and that's that's scary in itself, right? Uh, you know, it's like, not scary, but it's just like I just want to make sure that I'm not getting ahead of myself. That I'm making sure that everything rates right, everything's setting yeah. up right, that I'm seeing the market correctly, which uh, which I am. You know, I mean, yes. and I definitely think that. I mean, I think I think I can't see how we get up and around this situation here with the market. So are you have you you you're out of everything then. Everything no, to the downside. I'm still, I'm still in the spy option and the cues because I oh, really okay. think tomorrow it'll probably dip down again. So I wasn't, I wasn't, you know, I wanted to get out with green and and, and yeah. I really think I have conviction in them that they'll go down again. Okay, now Google flipped completely around. Did you do that one or not? Google because I wasn't in. Oh, okay. I don't. I, I couldn't get in on my phone on Friday, and Ben and I were in. Like we were, in, he was in three things. And then I had the two contracts in Apple, and I just like, and then you sent out Google, and I'm like, 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 I had to pull back and say, yeah, I think we're. That's okay. Then, that's all right. All right. All right. That's fine. So yes, you, did you do this to, 
Did you do this today then, or you didn't when I sent the second email out, or you just let it be? Which? I sent a which, second which, email out today, because the people that did do it, I said you could take more of this, so did you do oh, it, or you didn't do anything so with them? I didn't do the one on Friday, so therefore I didn't do the one okay. today, because also I was in the two apples, and I was in the spy in the queues. So okay. I just thought, especially with me being new to options, I thought it was probably just better that I, you know, just... Yeah. Because <laughs> at one time I had five, I, we, you called like five, I think they were wanting to be calls, but I was like in all five, I'm like, <laughs> you know, I just, it's too much. <laughs> but I mean, honestly, that has been like since the beginning of the year, like when I've been I doing know. these, like because I've been reading the market so well, it's almost like when I'm seeing what's going to happen, I call them all in a wave and like that's how, it, I mean, that's literally, yes. yeah. So last Monday though, I called a bunch. Did you get out of those ones? The 13th. I yes, I did. Okay. I did. I, I, I've been doing really good with the options. The only one that I had trouble with was there was a Netflix call that it was right before the, and I didn't get out when oh, I Oh, no, out. yeah. That one flipped around. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. But then I but called that, that one then. Did you I do well in it? And, and I just, I did well in so many of the other ones that I could really like wipe my hands of it and, and not feel that bad. What about the one for this here today, the Netflix? I didn't do that one because, like okay. I said, I was in the double uh, uh, two contracts of Apple and the other two. So I thought three for me was probably a good number of options to be in. Okay, well, that's fine. This did work, though. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I know. I saw. <laughs> Look back. Look back. No, that's okay. That's okay. All right. I think you're doing great. I think it's fun that yeah. you're doing the options now too with the day trades. I think if you keep yeah. doing well, then you can increase your risk a little bit more than for the next earning season. And you've got your sizing down now with your cheat sheets. I think that's good. Do you have any quick yeah. questions or? No, I just figured we'd be visiting July and I could tell you how it went. Well, of course, we'll probably talk. We'll talk for them. But mm -hmm. yeah, I'm just, uh, I loved when you did the, the, the uh, instruction last week and you made us all rate everything. And then, uh, you know, even today when you made us um, uh, our targets for Apple. Yeah. You know, I thought that, I, I love doing that because- Well, I need to do know. more of that. There was a guy in there who was trying to help and he just had a block and a mental block, you know? And then, yeah. you know, I mean, it's, you do have to like think it through. I mean, of course I can give the answers for every single solitary thing, but right. I do think it's, I think I should start to do some kind of regular thing like that we've been so busy though it's been so much going on in the mornings when i'm trying to I scan know. and look at rate so many different things make sure we get the good one but if we don't do something like that beforehand we can do start to do it in the non-busy season after the fact to go back and rate things but honestly it i know that it's helpful and yeah. i usually am giving everybody the answers so i think it's helpful when people start to to answer the answers and there was one that we went over Gosh, I, I said I didn't like it, and then we didn't do it. And there was something, there was, I forget what it was. It was a stock symbol that we looked at. It was last week. And I said, no, I don't like this, and here's why, and it's going to hold green. It was something that we did. Yeah. What the heck was it? It started with an F. I can't think of it. But if you think of it, remind me tomorrow. Because that, I showed you something on that, which has nothing to do with the class. I don't remember what it was. But nobody got the answer right. No, I, I, you told us it was because of the 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 long tail and the bottom and the buying at the top. You said, look at all that buying that came I know, in. I don't remember what it was though. Uh, oh. <laughs> oh, I don't either. Anyway, but stuff like that's good to do. Stuff like that is good to do. And then when I saw this morning, I'm like, oh my gosh, she's putting out options at 6 a.m. <laughs> I know, I know. Well, on buy do, I, I sent oh, that yeah. out like, I sent that out so early. It just yeah. crushed it through. And I, then that's when I quick sent it out. I'm like, well, people can figure this out on their own. I mean, sometimes yeah. I got to get it out. And then, I mean, I haven't been even putting targets in everyone. And then people have been like, what is the target? What is the target? Yeah. I mean, it's only, there's only so much time that one person could do so many things. But I yeah. really called this market so nicely. And so, yeah. I was so, I wasn't surprised at all when I saw the way we closed Friday and then gap down today. And I was just like, you know but it's going. yeah I mean you yeah. got gotta you gotta that's why if you take something and I, I think you've been good with this cause, but you've only been doing this for about a month when you take something if it hasn't gone yet don't kill it don't right. kill it right away because you've got to give it a chance and I am certain that people killed that apple I'm so certain nobody nobody emailed me so I know there's people out there that don't want to admit that they killed it 
because of the way that it was on Friday. Well, you said all week last week that Apple didn't look good, that Apple didn't look good. Mm -hmm. And you just kept saying that. So then when I had it on Friday, I'm like, you know, Melissa keeps saying Apple doesn't look good. So I'm just going with it. And then I, when you gave us the targets for Baidu, Ben was in the Baidu option. So oh. I screenshotted it, the targets, and I sent it to him. So oh, okay. There you go. <laughs> so we're a tag team, yeah. Yeah, you make a good husband and wife team. Yeah. He's going to be able to retire soon, too. <laughs> oh, that'd be nice. That'd well, that would be, really... be funny if you're both sitting there trading. Oh, my gosh. He, you know, he's more, oh, we were arguing about something. Uh, oh, I think it was uh, SWKS last week. Because yeah. He was like, you know, and and he's more conservative than me, and I'm like more like, yeah, let's go. It'll yeah. <laughs> Why? Well, yeah. What are you crazy? What did he want to do with it? What do you mean? Um, he just, I guess I didn't make. I, remember SWKS dropped. Yeah. And, dropped, and we were waiting for it to drop again. And remember, we took a little oh, more. Oh yeah. Yes. Our price point. If I had gone out when it first dropped, my uh, my profit would have been a lot better. Oh yeah, this was this was hard, but it you ended hard. up getting out. You you could have held it longer, but then I think you were you were like screw it, and you got out like with fifty yeah, bucks I or something. Yeah, as much, but it did it it did work. But but the the first drop was the best. I know, drop. but that's why this morning I'm like, you know what? Boom boom boom. You know, back yeah, into out. a groove and in and out, in and out, in and out, in and out, in and out. Yeah. Even though this did go lower all day, you, you never you never know. I know. Yeah, but you're doing great, Jackie. I'm, I'm, you're really That's picking awesome. it up. You're really doing well. You're thinking for so yourself. You. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I know. It's, I mean, the better I do, then the better you people do, and That's it all goes together. Yeah. That's the, what they, the the rising tide, you know, sails all ships, or there's some some. Oh yeah, like what that. is that? A rising tide lifts all ships. There you yeah, go. Yeah, there we go. That's a good one. I should put that in the email. Thank you. I'm the I'm the rising tide. <laughs> Got a lot of ships following me. Uh, uh, uh. So well, I, well, see you tomorrow in the room. I will see you tomorrow in the room. Congratulations. Tell your husband Thank I said you. hi. Okay. Bye. All right. Have a good night. Bye bye. You too. Bye.